So I've been messing around with RC cars for a while. And I realized there's some things I want to build on them. And of course, the logical step would be get them to 3D printing. Figured I would start with something good or decent. Not going with a full enclosure, but a bed slinger. And I went with this one. With a Bamboo Lab A1 combo. When I first decided to get the A1, they had just done the recall for the power cord. So this is, it just came back in the market. This is supposed to be the brand new updated, I'm gonna say corrected one with the bed slinger. I'm gonna do a quick unboxing on it. And I will show, and hopefully it is the updated one. One thing I did notice is, as you can see, it says March, 2024. We're now in May. And they're just now saying that was corrected. So we'll see. But um, stay with me. Let's get this unbox. Okay. I almost thought it was a CD. <laughs> I'm like, wow, that's old school. Nope. Just an instruction manual. Texture PA plate. Double sided. Texture on both sides. Okay. Discontinued. Huh, guess I got lucky. Okay. So although this is for the AMS kit. Parts, screws. Okay. We'll be building a little kit for this. We'll be printing a little kit for it. Kit. 
poop slinging. This is for the solo, for the single spool, I believe. be building it. If not, I'm just taking everything out. I was curious, it does bring in a memory card. And yes, this is the upgraded power cord. It's braided all the way to the tip, and it has a white connector there. It has this little attachment on it to prevent from getting too close. Show this. I'm going to show the ready parts. This on the bottom. Did notice that this one has red red markings. I like the videos. Everything I've seen shows green for the removal screws. Now I'm not going to record the assembly because they actually have a lot of videos on that already, and I'm sure they're going to be way better than what I'll put out there. Some tubing. Filament. I don't know what you could actually do with that. Some plastic. That's it. That's everything that comes in. I am happy to see it is the upgraded part. Can't wait to start printing. Hope this was helpful to somebody. If it was, or if you just want to see all the mistakes and errors I do on my 3D printing journey, give me a follow. Thank you.